due to poor liquidity, high latency, and a lack of compelling product offerings. Today's central limit order book decentralized exchanges have a limited usability. In addition to these problems, almost all DEXs have rather centralized designs, which make them vulnerable to censorship and unreliable. The community is of the opinion that these issues need to be resolved in order to fully realize the potential of decentralized finance. That's where Injective Protocol and its features showing the potential to change the landscape. So without any delay, let's start with what is Injective Protocol. Decentralized Derivatives Exchange Injective Protocol is based on Ethereum and supported by a Layer 2 solution that gives investors quick and secure access to DeFi markets. When we discuss Injective Protocol, we don't just mean a decentralized exchange with yield farming and token swapping options. Instead, we're looking at a DEX that focuses on the derivatives market. The goal of Injective Protocol is to provide DeFi investors who are craving decentralization with futures, margin, spot trading, and perpetual swaps. Every component that supports the decentralized exchange, according to Injective Labs, is constructed in a way that is censorship resistant, open, and completely trustworthy. The project is composed primarily of three different parts. First component is the Injective Chain. Injective Chain is a Layer 2 sidechain and Cosmos Zone connected to Ethereum. It makes use of verifiable delay functions to enforce an equitable transaction ordering consensus that through proof of elapsed time reflects actual time. This resolves Ethereum's critical race conditions and minor extractable value problems. Currently, Injective Chain operates as a decentralized trade execution coordinator, hosts a decentralized open order book, and powers the Layer 2 derivatives platform. The chain allows for the transfer and trading of Ethereum-based assets on the Injective Chain and is constructed on top of Tendermint. Now let's present second component called Injective Exchange. Injective turns an exchange into a decentralized public utility, unlike conventional exchanges, which act as gatekeepers to the cryptocurrency industry. Injective stands out because it makes available to the general public each element of a decentralized exchange. By removing the technical barrier to entry for individuals and enabling them to freely operate a highly performative exchange, this transforms the conventional business model of exchanges. Relayers in the Injective network are rewarded by the model of Injective for sourcing liquidity. By doing this and competing with one another to offer better user experiences, exchange providers are encouraged to better serve users. The last component has a name of Injective Futures. Decentralized perpetual swaps, contracts for difference, and short CFDs, and many other derivatives are currently supported by the decentralized peer-to-peer -peer futures protocol known as Injective Futures. With just a price feed, the protocol enables users to build and trade on any derivative market. Now let's present the native token of Injective and why is it important. The decentralized public utility and governance token of Injective is called the INJ token since it affects governance, derivatives collateralization, market makers, protocol security, relayer incentives, and other things, it is very significant. But apart from that, the largest buyback and burn mechanism in the cryptocurrency exchange market is used by Injective. 60% of all Injective fees, including those from all exchange decentralized applications built on Injective, are burned every week. The result is a general deflationary supply that gradually increases the scarcity of the INJ token. In conclusion, Injective Protocol was created specifically for developing decentralized applications. With its technology, Injective can lower trading costs, improve order execution and liquidity, and get rid of front-running. By utilizing technological advancement to facilitate, accelerate, and decentralize trading, Injective Protocol is establishing a new type of decentralized economy. The platform provides users who want to take part in crypto asset trading in a decentralized market with more secure and effective access to crypto assets, potentially revolutionizing the financial sector.
So that's the end of the video around everything about Injective and its token. Now if you have found the content helpful, don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video until then, goodbye.